Hello, you have reached TVA's Community Outreach Voice Mailbox. Please leave us a message with your name and your phone number, and we will return your call as soon as possible. Thank you for calling. Hi, I was just calling uh, TVA to let you guys know that on February 3rd, 2009, uh, approximately 5.30 p.m., uh, there's uncontrolled fugitive dust coming off of the, the TVA disaster site. Hey, is this Bob Alexander? There's no wind in your phone. I can barely hear you. Yeah, I was just saying, did you not, uh, did you read TVA's MSDS sheet where it said not to breathe in the coal dust? Uh, hold on a second. What you use an MSDS format is to determine if you need to, to have the people that are working in that area to use personal protective equipment. It's, it talks about the concentrations uh, that are permissible in terms of the, you know, the uh, measurements, milligrams per cubic meter. You know, and, and most of that is, is, is similar to concentrations if you were working in a very dusty environment, you know, like on a on a, an industrial exposure somewhere. Our our numbers, our, our air monitoring numbers are nowhere near that uh, at this point. So, you know, uh, hey, this is Matt Landon. I'm uh, I'm calling today from it's uh, February third, and. Uh, 2009, we're down here at Harriman, Tennessee. We're right across the river on uh, on Emory River Road, and I just wanted to let you know that uh, the dust is kicking up, and uh, I'm just wondering what the Tennessee Department of Environment and Conservation is going to do about the air quality right now. Yeah, do you have a respirator on there, Bob? Are you on site? I'm on site. I'm here on the south end. I'm on the downwind end. Yeah. I don't want too much dust. Yeah. I am. Do you want to uh, drive over here and see it before, uh, you know, before before the sun goes down? Yeah. Are you wearing a respirator? I don't believe there's a need for that right now, Matt. Yeah. Bob Alexander. Oh, is he over there? <laughs> yep, T Deck. Our T Deck yeah. official is on site and he just informed me that there's no dust storm on site. What? And I told him to come over to the Emory <laughs> River side so that he could see exactly what we're seeing. So. Yeah, yeah take you a photo of it and send it to these guys so that they can relate, you know, for today's air quality measurements, they can relate what you're saying. Uh, to the numbers that they will get for today, okay? Yeah. We get those numbers probably every day.